this video, my buddy Dan Diggins does a blind test of a Mexican and an American Fender Telecaster guitar to see if there is a difference and how much if so. This video does not represent all USA and Mexican Telecasters because there are so many versions. Just the ones we have here in the studio today. Dan, welcome back to the studio. Through the years, there's always been the American Fender versus the Mexican Fender. Yeah. Just the other day, I heard the conversation, which we've all heard, which is better? Is it worth mm. the more money for the American Fender? Yeah. Or by saving a lot of money, is it the Mexican Fender is good, but it's just cheaper? Right. So today, mm. we're going to give you a blind test. Oh, okay. You're going to be the judge. And tell us honestly what you think. Okay. Why you would buy the Mexican or why you would buy the American or both. Right. <laughs> it could be a tie. Well, then, why not just buy both? <laughs> <laughs> it's only money. I've seen a t-shirt and I want to get myself one one day. It's, it says on it, I have too many guitars. Said nobody ever. <laughs> Where did you see it? Uh... Yeah. <laughs> It was posted on a bulletin board at work. Somebody had a picture of it. It was on saw it on the internet and printed it. If you so find out, send it to me. Okay. I got we'll sell them maybe on the show here yeah. and I'll leave it in the comments yeah. below. Yeah. I've always wanted to do that. There'll be a link in the comments below. Well let's get, let's get to it. Let's 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 are you, uh, are you trying to rush me? Well, not really, no. <laughs> um wait till you see how I'm gonna hide the identity of the guitars. Okay. Okay, so I have no idea if this is the American Tele or the uh, Mexican Tele. The controls feel nice. They're nice and smooth. got individual saddles here which is nice three position switch the action, the action is nice it's very responsive nice sustain It's a nice guitar. The neck is nice, relatively flat. I mean, that's just the way the neck is, but it's nice. It's a comfortable, comfortable guitar. Got a nice telly quack to it. This, this is a very nice guitar it's got a it's got a bit of a belly cut here which i always I always like that i find that real comfortable on a on a telly uh nice nice guitar for sure so one out of ten that's hard to say because i mean it's the first time i've ever held the guitar in my hand i mean i don't feel anything so wrong we'll with it other than uh, setups are always personal to people, you know, like every I set my guitars up probably differently than you would or anybody else So I mean probably one of the first things I would do would be Set this up a little differently change the action and that but that that's all personal stuff But really there's I don't feel anything on this guitar that makes me go. Ooh, I don't like that or yeah. I wouldn't like that, you know, I just it, it, It's a it's a nice it feels like a, a quality instrument uh and, and it sounds nice. It sounds really nice. Very responsive, lots of sustain, and it comfortable to play. Plays well. Are you ready for number two? Sure. I, I really like the uh, the finish on this. The I mean, that's just a personal thing. Some guys like the the sunburst. I've always liked this natural wood thing. It just I'm I'm a carpenter. I'm a wood guy, so I really like the the finish on this and the grain. And aesthetically, I find it really nice. Mm -hmm. 
something feels different in the in the the knobs i'm not sure if it's just no oh, the shape of the knob is different these ones are, are rounded over on the top the other ones were more flat so it just feels a little bit different on the hand but you know that and it looks different so in my mind that may be equating to there's something different about that because it feels a little different but but that, the, you, the have the amp set the, you have the amp set the same way so there's no change in nothing's the tone. changed on the amp nothing's changed in the tone it's exactly the same thing so here's here's this guitar on the neck pickup <laughs> It's got a nice quack to it, that telly quack. Yep, it's hard to tell, you know, uh, other than just being a different guitar, I really can't feel a heck of a lot of difference. I don't know if it could be the, the pickup uh, in that, the pickups in that other one may be a little different or the, the height of the pickups seems to be a little uh, more lively than this one, a little more responsive maybe. <laughs> but this is, this is a nice guitar. It's feels a little bit smoother to play and I don't know if this is the Mexican one or the American one but it just something about the neck feels a little bit different it just well that's a lot of sustain to just grab a note and hang on to it like just, was it the same for the other guitar for sustain uh it would I mean they're both really good this this it just the neck just feels a little a little more comfortable on this one Mm -hmm. And I'm not sure if it's because of the profile of the neck. It feels like it it could be a modern C shape or something, maybe. I don't know. It just feels a little more comfortable than the other one. I always recommend to anybody, if you're trying guitars, um, <laughs> try them. Sit down and play them if you can. And, uh, and there's me being a hypocrite because I bought a Les Paul off a of reverb from a guy in Florida that, that I bought sight unseen. And I'm lucky that when I got it, I really liked it. But, you know... The, the, I, I really like, well, I mean, just personally, I like this one better just because of the, the finish and the, it just feels a little nicer to me, a little, a little more, I don't even know if it's quality. It just feels a little, just something about it I like better. Well, take the bag off and have a look okay. and tell us which guitar yeah. that is. So this says, if you'd like to see more of my channel, Please hit subscribe and hit the notification bell. Corona, California. So this is the American one. It just feels a little... It, it's hard to even describe it. It just it just feels like there's something a little more in the details and the quality. Not, not, a, not much of a difference. I guess it depends. If somebody... Some people like to spend a lot more money on guitars and get that. I don't know what the price difference on these these is, but about a thousand bucks. Yeah, quality, tone, playability, they're pretty close. Well, Dan, thank you so much for coming out and doing this comparison for us. My pleasure, Roy. It's a pleasure to be here, and uh, nice to be able to play some quality instruments like this too. Well, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember, go out and see a live band. Be good to each other, and until next time.